this is Gavarok, welcoming you to Let's Play Evoland. Um, basically the game has absconded with one of the chests. Now what I mean by that is, okay, last video you saw me go into this meadow, and I killed these four armored things, and I opened a chest which transformed the meadow into a village. It's a very clever unlock, like you unlocked a village and it just springs to life around you. I like that, that that's great. But I didn't really get to comment on it because I was too busy wondering where the other bloody chest was. Um. In that meadow, there's meant to be a chest with a card in it, the slime uh, card for Double Twin. But it wasn't there. It's meant to be in the top right corner of the little field, and when you turn the thing into a village, um, you can't go back to the meadow. Now, I've read from half the sources I've read say that once, if you miss it, you miss it and it's gone. Uh, the other half say that if you don't pick up the chest, then when you go back into the village, it'll be the meadow again, which it very clearly isn't. Um, but I don't know which one is right, because what I encountered was completely different. If you look at my video, you'll notice that in the top right corner of the... Well, it's hard to say top right corner, because it's sort of a circle area. But in the top right area of that meadow, there was no chest. I restarted the game, which obviously only took me five minutes to do, because it's a short game and I'm at the beginning, uh, and went through and there was still no chest. Now, the first time I played, it was there. I got it. I got all 25, uh, 23 cards. But this time, and seemingly every other time, it's not there. Now, I don't really care that much, because, like I said, I, I've already gotten 100% once before. And it, it really isn't very much. But it's kind of a bitch, given this is the recording. Oh, actually, I should probably set my timer so I know how long I've been going for. Last time I only went for 15 minutes, but I thought I went for 18 because I had an issue with my watch. Anyway, yeah. So it looks like we're not going to get all the cards. Oh, well. Sucks to be... Well, no one, really, because it's a short game and it doesn't really matter. Uh, it doesn't make a difference in the long run. It just means I don't get to have a two-second conversation with some guy and make him happy because I can't get all the cards. I'll get all the others to show you where they are, but yeah, pretty much somewhere in the village. <laughs> I don't know. I don't understand. Somewhere in the meadow, rather. I don't know. I don't know why it didn't show up for me. It's just gone. Vanished into the ether. Oh, well. It's pretty bare village, eh? Not much to see. Can't go into any rooms. Well, well, well. Nah, we'll stay up here. Are we going in? No! It's also really big compared to us. Like the trees, the buildings, everything is big. Why are we so small? You got enter houses. You can now freely invade people's privacy. Lovely. Plus, there's no one in here. Innkeeper. We unlocked a human being. Okay. Uh, I'm not tired. I want to go to bed. Right. Where else? There's a thing. House. Area. This looks shoppy, but there's no shopkeeper. Oh no, we unlocked him. He was bundled in a chest in the side of his room. Sorry, the National Sword Association does not allow us to sell weapons to children yet. We're not a child. Actually, maybe we are. He's a lot bigger than us. Locked. Maybe there's something in here. Oh yes, I remember. An NPC! Sorry, I don't speak to children. What are you doing here? Children should go to bed. If you're not a nice boy, the e Kefka's ghost will come and eat you. Kefka's ghost. Right. Sorry, I don't speak to children. Well... You can get buggered up whichever hole you prefer. <laughs> I'd love it if children actually talk like that. Oh wait, they do. Stop bothering me. Go play with other children. 
can't stop thinking I'm a kid. I just fought my way through a treacherous meadow. I got a card. Well, that's good. Should have another one. Nope, I only get four. Oh, I found a potion. Actually, yeah. You can find things by clicking on barrels. Whoa. Nothing there. Nothing there. There's a few secrets in this village. I can't quite remember them. In any case, let's go down the well. What the hell are you doing in this place? Yes, I want to eat it. Yay! Adultification! Woo! Complete with some weird visor thingy on my head. And another card. Get up then. I heard a lot of strange sounds coming out of the North Caves. A girl visited us earlier. Is she a friend of yours? But why would she be? So I can't get in there. You can sort of go around to the side, can't you? I swear you can. Uh, mm. Ah, yeah, here we go. <laughs> Secret! Cobra Zero! Right then. I got the star! This house doesn't even have a door. It's got one on the other side. Alright, well, that's interesting game design, that right there. Let's head around, back through the secret. Da -da -da -da, secret. Welcome to the Papadika village. Please enjoy your stay with us. Oh yeah, I forgot about the kid. You uh, tell, talk to the kid and he tells you to go to the well to get the adult thingy. Adults are not funny. Oh yeah, yeah. If only I could eat the growth seed, I would no longer be a child. But the seed I found has fallen down the well. Oh, Jesus. How to cook an emook by KFC. <laughs> like it. Hey, money. Money in a barrel. I just robbed you. Now I'm going to use your money to buy a sword. Pretty much at this point, the only thing that fighting is good for, or random battles rather, because there's no such thing as experience, is getting money. You don't equip items, you just buy them. That will make me slightly tougher. Those are consumables. And that is a double twin card. So really, you just grind a bit, get cash, spend it, buy out the shop, and continue on with the game. One of the more tedious parts of Evo Land, but nonetheless an important part of RPG gaming. I must admit, if they didn't give us a grinding challenge, then it wouldn't be a true parody. Though I do still want to punch them in the face. I don't think there's any more secrets. I think that, that one go up the side of the thingy was the only one. Unless there's a thing in here. No. You can just get yourself stuck. Or something. Yay, I'm tramping on the flowers because I'm a douche like that. Nope, you can't get in there. But I will open the door for no reason other than ha ha ha. Yeah, that's about it. Nothing else in this village of wonders, unless there's something to be had around the corner. Stuck there. There are quite strong monsters in the cave ahead. We won't let you pass with your current equipment. Yeah, pretty much you, the game just tells you to go grind. Ah well, if a grinding we must go, a grinding we shall go. I'm not going to do the whole 
get 500 bucks to um, buy a monster game while on video, but I will get the 50 I need to buy armor to pass the checkpoint. And by the 50 I need, I mean it's literally two fights. Actually, I will. I will get the, the money I need for the card, because, wow, that was quick. Um, <laughs> You don't really need Phoenix Downs either, because you won't lose anybody. Plus with the sword, you just, yeah, you cut through them before, as you saw in uh, the last video. You were rather weak, but now it's just bang, bang, every enemy is worth 50 gliss. Or glees. Or glyce. Or nitroglycerin, if that's what you prefer. How many potions have I got? Three. Mm, probably buy a couple more, but I don't really care. Like I said, the uh, turn-based battle is not very complicated, and really, you you don't do much of it. Most of the big dungeony areas are, um, what's the word, action-adventure style, where you, as this fellow, just chop things with your sword, much like we did in the first area. But yeah, in this way, it's sort of it's a nice little back and forth between Zelda gameplay and Final Fantasy gameplay. But it sticks more to the zelda -y stuff because that can actually be a challenge. Whereas they'd have to like develop a full system to make the turn-based stuff a challenge. Really, they just make it more of a joke. Which is fine, I don't mind jokes. I tell a lot of them. Sometimes they're funny. Most of the time they're just fun. Fifty more and we've got enough. Unless we buy Phoenix Downs, but I think they'll be fine. Actually, I'll fight one more, because while we could buy both the armor and the card, we'd also not have money to stay at the inn, and I just walked into the village by accident. One. Ow. Two. Three! I get out of my face. Hello, in. I'm going to stay in you. <laughs> yeah, I suppose. And you save your game when you're in the inn, because that's what all good RPGs do. You save your game when you're in the inn. <laughs> in the inn. I should shut up. Armor. You are now equipped. You got equipped. Because they forgot to put the extra P on there. So I will not give them the dignity of saying it right. Card emook. Fuck. Well, we got two potions. And hopefully no one will die in the ensuing dungeon. <laughs> okay, I think that's everything in the village, but if it isn't, I can go back later. There are a few cards and stars that are difficult to find. God, I hate the fact that I'm not going to be able to get all 23. It's just really annoying, you know? And there's no good reason for it other than... Idiot game glitch. Oh well. And seriously, people who are going to... Like, I didn't fully capture what it was, like, I don't think. Maybe in the last video it was there and I just didn't grab it, but... When I went back, it was not there. You don't, t don't tell me that, oh, you, you, you know, you only can't get it because you can't go back to the meadow now. If you restart, it'll be there. It wasn't there. I don't know why, it just was not where it should have been. So, please don't bullshit. <laughs> it just wasn't there. <laughs> I don't understand it any better than you. You got forced fight. Oh, God. Oh, God, she's dead. Well, that's a good start, isn't it? Right, let's kill Stevens. Actually, Phoenix Down would have been useful, wouldn't it? Oh well. The two nameless wonders shall battle into the night. Oh, she comes back with a method. Thank you for saving me from these- No, oh, that's gonna hurt my throat. Thank you for saving me from these monsters. I need the crystal in the cave to save my hometown. Will you help me? <laughs> no is grayed out. <laughs> I like that. You got forced choice. Looks like the scenario is lacking proper branching here. 
By the way, my name is... Kairos. Kairos has joined the team. Of course, we don't have a name, but she does. Good for her. She, uh, got a decent amount of health. Yeah, she's fine. Can you buy equipment for her? I don't know. Actually, no, you, you literally can't. I don't know why I'm coming back here to verify that. I know you can't. So let's continue on. Ah, random battle. Is that annoying? She can heal. This is good. We're gonna benefit from that. These things tend to smack us. She can't fight as well as he can, though, which is a pain. Now, there's the cave we need to go to, but first of all... We will fight an emu. And murder its face. Then we will continue and go to this inconspicuous location. The Hidden Meadow. Another action adventure area. No random encounters over here. You got the card slime. But wasn't that the one that was meant to be? I swear that was the one that was meant to be in the... That's what I watched in the video. I don't know. I don't understand. Last time I played this game, I collected a card from that area. This time, the same card is over here. <laughs> well, maybe I just looked at the video wrong. I swear it was meant to be slime, though. You got True Explorer. You have found the hidden cave. Did I miss anything? Just up there? It wasn't really there. Was there another branch? I don't think there was. I'm a moron and probably just prolonging the amount of time it takes me to get through this cave. This is a random encounter area, but yeah, there's no experience, so really there's no point to fighting at all other than money. And I've bought everything I need to make myself strong. Let's go to the left first, because that's my usual. This area is totally optional. And all it has in it is some extra collectibles. Invasion of the Undead <laughs> Love it. I don't think I saw that last time. I remember it. Steven. They don't sound healthy. Money! Must be funny in a rich man's world. The star! The star of the show. Of the video. I should shut up, I'm not funny. These are pretty bloody weak if she can one shot them. Good of you, video game. And yeah, there's nothing else. Or is there? There might be a. Yeah. There's a few things like this. Areas where pretty much it's just a, a, a walk off to the side in such a way as if you didn't have a guide with you, you're not going to find you. The only reason I knew to do that is because I remembered it. Um, I'm probably going to miss them though, there's a few of them and I, I will miss them. I will probably just pick a later video and be like, and now I go and get all the stuff I missed. And then I will get all the stuff I missed. Now if I recall there was actually more. Yep. Perseverance for dummies, no need for that. Was that there? Maybe not. get into another five billion random encounters while I hug the walls. Oh, why would they do it up? You can't even see. Yeah, okay. Backwards. Wait, let me through. There we go. Right then. The game is clever, but the game is mean. Now, Kairis, you're looking a bit green. Probably use that heal. It's not a very good heal. But it works. 
keep using it. They will keep getting better. And there's no MP, obviously, because this game is incredibly simplistic, so you don't have to worry about that. Now, have I missed anything else? I think there was one other branching path, and there might be another hidden passage, but if there is, I don't remember it, so I'm not going to look for it. Glees. Glees. Christ. Yes, there's a way here. At least the sort of is. Actually there isn't. Oh die, you bloody rat. I do not like your kind. I am prejudiced against anything that might like to random encounter me. Or, you know, encounter me randomly. Uh, one more check, just to make it absolutely go away. There you go, off the bugger. Make absolutely sure. Yes, we're fine. Up and away we go. And onwards and awaywards. Crystal caves. We need to find the crystal. Well, no shit. Power can change your perception of the world. Interesting. And with it, you can fight the evil that threatens my village. Wait, she's a girl. By the way, I just noticed that I forgot to ask your name. Clink. Brilliant. You got a name. You're an actual human being now. Yay! <laughs> It's gotta be it. No? Wow. Okay. Cave monsters. Jesus. Oh, we're at 20 minutes. We should probably bugger off. Oh, wow. You don't take hits, do you? Jeez. Eight. Miss. Christ! Ah, oh, well it dies, it hasn't got high health, it's got high defense. Oh, and different music in here too, that's nice. Hmm. Yeah, we're at 20 minutes, we should probably wrap up. Oh. Cobra Zero, yes, yes, I've heard about you. Oh, right, you, you, you sounded like you'd be a lot tougher was actually quite disappointing. You should be ashamed of yourself and you should go home crying to your mother. In any case. So that I can come back in a future video and continue to play this game. Since frankly, my back hurts. I don't want to go lie down. I'll die already. I'm not... There we go. That's better. Out you get, out you get, out you get, out you get. Very nice. Now, I think it saves when you do that. Let me see. Oh, shoot. How many cards have I got? Six. Oh, Jesus. Okay, when we come back, I'll have done the hidden meadow again. Because this game's mean. Really, really mean. Look, very mean. Okay, fare thee well. <laughs>